Isn't this amazing? Of course I'm on CoStar Survival Server and this is a hand molded ice covered bridge. This is from Beardette. He's the owner of Blackwell and take a look at where Blackwell is. Only three massive levels below a layer of ice all hollowed out. Oh yeah and there's the snow. Take a look here. You see these two little structures on the side and this one? They're open in the middle. So we're actually going to see that snow all the way through. It's beautiful. Let's go ahead and head on inside and hit the rails. Remember I told you guys there's a huge rail push here because it's just so convenient to get around. Well, it's also, hey, slime. All right, well, I knew this was a slime chunk. I guess we get to... Uh, walk the first round. The uh, Usually they're on the bottom level. This particular area is even set up for the rails right here in the middle. We've got a quick drop there and then of course the ladder back up if you want. And there, that's what I was telling you. He left the middle to open here for two reasons. Hey slime, stop pushing me. Uh, for two reasons. One, to let the beauty of the snow come in and two to let the sunshine in helps light up that very very dark basement floor there at the bedrock and that's his residential area so it, it's good to have some light we have a beautiful little bit of uh, biome experience down here in this snowy park check that out for an ancient tree a little bit of everything down here of course, the uh, pumpkins tucked into the uh, into the tops. That is so cool. And we have our little farms here. So you might as well spruce up the farm area. Chicken slaughterhouse, the eggs dropping, with a bit of yeah, a bit of, of life, a bit of warmth. And we've got, of course, our wheat farm. Up there's another wheat farm, a generic bee wheat farm, right here. Meridair is communicating. And just leaving some information. The diggy area, one floor down, I put two holes, you should see. Just dig between the stone blocks, goes up 18. So they're coordinating the next work project. We've seen that before. Let's go ahead and see if we're going to be able to ride our rails down one more floor. We'll go to the lower level, and like I said, it's, it's really a beautiful thing the way this particular rail line is, because you get a tour ouch a tour of what you're about to come up on man they just made their way up hey you don't get my cart I think you're down below yeah you're just ghosting through okay so if the resident slimies will let me in here this level we have uh, some more farm areas but we also have some cool buildings hey you're getting pushy now all right, so over here, we've got the Blackwell Butcher right outside the, uh, ow, right outside the farm for the animals, I, for the cows. I love the refrigerator. Hey, what did I tell you guys? What did I tell you guys about trying to get cameos? I'm filming here. <laughs> okay, so... We've got the, the butcher, we've got uh, the hatchery right here. Oh yeah, and we just literally updated 1.25. So you can see the various uh, doors are still having to be reset. And of course the sheep shear looks like white, gray, and black are the order of the day. Now here's part of that diggy diggy here stuff. And that's where they're clearing, you've got more storage. They've got expansion projects. Always, always the towns are expanding and growing. It's amazing. All right, now this particular one is an interesting building because it, there's two parts all housed in one. Really nice look here. So we're going to go over here, the mayor's room and the lookout points. Of course, you have a lookout there. That slime really wants in this shot. And up here, Beardette's place. 
again, just nice spots to look around. Little uh, workbench area. We've got our fire, warm us up. The little bath, shower. Gotta love it. Personal things, and of course, our eating station. Now we're gonna go back down. Yeah, if I can find my way back down. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go back down. I wanna show you the enchanting area, but mostly the potions. The way it's set up. See, here's our enchanting for with our book. But look at the brewing. I love how he's done his water. Of course, you could take from the middle and have it be an infinite. But I just love how it's freestanding, just hanging out there. Very cool. All right, let's head back to the next area. This one is so cool where it's got the uh, above it's like that's the residence and this is just a really interesting base so right here is the inn inquire within with beer debt if you want a, a room so again like we've seen before a hotel a central location that type of thing so he has chosen to leave the rooms pretty much empty he's given you just a basic chest you can place things where you might want them, etc. And then you can go from there. So each of these rooms, there's even, I hear you zombie, a, li a lovely balcony here that everybody can step out and take a peek. And there is one more tucked up in the loft. I love this one. The loft, it's free. You've got, yeah, just a little space, a unique little space here. Tucked in if you wanted to come up here and claim the loft for your own. So again, anybody interested? Beardette's got space. Now for the... Oh, I don't want you. <laughs> now, let's go take a look at the residential and then we're going to move on to Ridgecrest. I'm going to try to ride my rail. I don't know that we're going to have much luck. Lower level. Let's see if we can beat the slime so they all made their way up to harass. Oh, there's a skelly up there. Hello, skelly. See, it's still mighty dark. Ah! <laughs> okay, well attack of the killer slime balls man I am so jealous where's my big giant slime chunk in my single player world nowhere hey hey slimy back off back off <laughs> oh mama Your debt, I expect pay for this. <laughs> I have hired. <laughs> you need to hire somebody to clear your slime. <laughs> okay, I think the evasion is almost done. You too. Well, that was one exciting way to get down here. One exciting way to get down here indeed. Okay, so now that I've cleaned up all of my stuff, let's start this. Hey there. Let's start this again. I'm going to go up and retrieve my thing, my uh, cart. So, press, oh, I did get it, good. Press the button to ride the upper le le levels. Press the button to ride to upper levels. Then we've got our uh, kind of like two-phase, sort of a 50-50. We've got the uh, regular world and the nether world here. We have a lovely fountain. Future home of Beeve. So that's a construction process. A lot of people are going to the uh, mailbox set up here. We've got DC Bond. Another big giant slime. 
down. Down, I say. So this is DC Bond's house, which we will take a peek at as soon as I safely can. You didn't know this was going to be fighting slimes with honey, did you? <laughs> okay. So, slipping in here. We've got his place. Looks like it's kind of a work in progress. He has completed the exterior. Has a lovely little porch area. Let's go next door. Did you see that present? I've already peeked at it a couple of times. Take a look. And the fountain. He's got all of this newly marked off as lots. Two King from Beer Dad also includes plot. So build. There you go. And these are all just empty plots waiting for uh, for people. As you can see, the light gets down. Well, it's probably night up above. But the uh, during the day, the light gets down just enough. Yeah, it's going to be evening up there. Just enough. You can see we've lit up right here. But as soon as you go out of range, it is so dark. All right. So wait, wait, wait. I passed the sign. Joker Mage's Cold Energy Research Lab. All right. Do we dare venture? We do. So we have a nice little setup here. Joker and his laboratories across the four corners of CoStar Survival Server. Nice little setup here. All right, I think that just about wraps us up. Building in progress here. There's that little one. We have to take a look at this house and the black well. Loserific's Lodge. Very nice. Loser always makes a nice, warm, cozy area. Home <laughs> sweet home. Very cool. Let's look at the black well which is right here, the historic Blackwell. And I will tell you right now, this is not a place that you want to fall down. We've had to rescue people more than once. That's, a, <laughs> that's an ice house you have. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, I'm gonna make my way back up and we're gonna go take a look at Mega's place, Ridgecrest. Be right back. Okay, so here we are. We're back at the top. Are you ready for the epic, epic trip to Ridgecrest? It is so far. Look! The wool that marks their border. Ta-da! It's here. They are literally neighbors. So here we are in the town of Ridgecrest. I have to say it slowly because I keep wanting to say quest. So, let's get on a main road and take a look. Here's M.D. Miller's abode. Very nice. We've got our little gardens. Using the lily pads for walking. Cozy, cozy. Obviously, the building style here is wood and uh, the dark pine accents. And everybody has nice, kind of a... Um, Pitched roof, that's part of it. Pitched roof and preferably a regular standard oak pitched roof, you know, just the standard stairs. So those are kind of the, uh, the building requirements here. Everything is again well trimmed, well maintained. The rows of pine trees. Another snug as a bug little cabin here. One sec, Mary Dare, I'll get you. Murder. <laughs> That's how you're supposed to say it. Is murder like murder? Ridgecrest Town Hall. We're actually gonna save that one because there's a cool thing downstairs I want to show you. Let's finish off over here first. The blacksmith again. Ignore the derpy blacksmith. They are broken, but it's still a cool little spot for him to hang out. Over here. There's a various farms. There's the sheep, the cows, etc. This is actually one of the homes that was built. Move in ready. Short sale. Motivated seller. This is one that uh, was pre-built. Mega built this. We've seen that before where people have uh, made pre-built homes. 
somebody new to the server can come in. You've even got a jukebox there. Really cool. And it's, it's a different style than some of the other houses, too. Just as a nice example to tell people, hey, you can... Um, you can do it, whatever it is that you want here within those guidelines. And of course, comes with a fully installed basement, ready to be furnished. There are a couple places like this. In fact, I think the second one has been uh, claimed by the Snow Council. We'll take a quick drive-by through there. DC Bond. Yeah, right over here. More animals to the right. The Snow Council have claimed this one. King, Beer, and Mega. Now, the Snow Council would be the three towns in the snow biomes. I've already showed you Beer Debts. This is Megas. And we'll have to take a look at Kings another time. We're not going to have time to do them all. So here you go. This is their little pad. Mega told me he wanted just a, a nice, you know, something different, a nice little oasis in the middle of the cold, cold nights. He said this would be good for a, a nice, thick-blooded viking. So there you go. Across the way here we've got another Joker Mage place. This is the Dendrogenics Lab. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Now hiring. Nether Research Assistants do not take bacon from the trees. Creeper Tree Research has been completely terminated. That sounds like a good plan. So let's take a look at this research. Nether tree. Research suspended. What is this? I don't even... Okay, we're just moving on. That was a failed experiment. Bacon tree. Presumed successful. But, of course, everybody took the bacon off of it. So, we will just move on from there. Joker has a great sense of humor. And does this look familiar? Honey's Ridgecrest home. Do I have any mail? Nope. Sometimes people exchange things in there, so there you go. This looks familiar. This is my house. I actually rebuilt it sort of on the stream. Uh, most of it was done on the stream, and I recreated my house with my very complicated roof line for everybody to uh, kind of see and hang out with me. So here we go. Put up my pictures, everything's nice and cozy. Like I said, we've just changed to 1.25, so I haven't fixed my doors yet either. It's just been busy with other moderator things setting up. All right, so again, I've just, it's the same as my uh, house. Although, as you can see, I don't have the nether brick because the request here was for the pitched roof to be in that uh, standard stairs so that's what I used so other than that it is the same just those minor differences which you know what I can do that and over here I see you Mare Dare <laughs> over here we've got uh, I, uh, price if you have to ask 90210 uh oh alright so we've got a newly expanded area here and this would be the first Ridgecrest Church of Notch. Yeah, Mayor, you're not stalking, just looking. So, services 7 a.m., 10 a.m. on the third Saturday of every week. Okay. So we have a really pretty building here. With quite the expensive decoration up there. Little pulpit. We have, uh, I like the detail here with the little crack stuff. And then, over here, it's just more lots set aside. So everybody's kind of setting up. There's room for people to grow. New people come in. They can take a lot and plays wedding music. The last house on the left, special price. Now, I'm going to head back over to the town hall because there's really a lot more to the town hall than just a, a basic gathering building. He has chosen to make the town hall the central storage area as well as all the other access things special stuff you might want to take a look at so there we go the village welcome to the village of Ridgecrest enjoy your stay farms and transportation located in the basement annex there we go building codes right there mega so we have our basic areas up above kind of a hangout spot you can go up above again 
and you've got the library, the crackling fires. Ta da! That looks dangerous. That shouldn't be there. <laughs> well, I'll take care of that. Good thing we don't have spider spread on here. But down below is what I really want to show you. So give me a second to get navigated down there. We're not going to push that button. Those of you on the stream already saw me push that button. There's secrets down there. Okay, we've got everything down here. The skeleton traps, the slime area, the branch mines, drinking fountain, nice touch, the nether portal, this way. You've got the tranquil grove. Again, just a beautiful tucked in park. Here we go with all the vines. Only you can prevent forest fires. Watch out for falling slime. And we just have a beautiful park down here with the mushrooms, the, uh, the lighting, the pines. It's just gorgeous. So there's various things down here. You've got a train station. You've got a massive storage room behind that button, the secret button that I have shown to everybody repeatedly town hall exit and of course there's farms down here he's chosen to kind of keep all of his farms besides the animal things tucked away and hidden the obsidian farm the wheat the cactus everything your heart can desire and then dun 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 the train station leads to everywhere tunnel 7 reserve tunnel 6 tunnel 5 main hall maintenance keep out all the redstone works so we have all of these connected up blackwall acorn frostbite and they're in the process right now of making more connections and there's murder over there of uh, making more connections the next one when i show you the snow council with the uh, king's area there's another major major train station so that's it that's gonna do it for now i was kind of hoping to get to all three but there is just way too much stuff till next time guys see ya